So, as you will know if you watched last episode, and if you haven't, go and watch it. I'll put a link in the card in the top right of me. I'll just move out the way so you can actually see. There we go. Oh, that took a bit of adjusting. I'm still getting used to this new camera setup, as I'm sure you can tell. Uh, but yeah, after the video, she put her rankings on her story of what she predicted her, uh, how she would rate the rides at Alton Towers. Uh, as you can tell from the video, I wasn't impressed by some of her thoughts on what she thought some of them were like. Um, we had a bit of a debate, it's safe to say, in episode 6. Uh, and yeah, um, I'm only going to say that things got even more heated after she put her predictions on her Instagram story. But now she has just got back from Alton Towers, so I thought, why not start recording another video? And I thought I'd get the footage rolling just before uh, we're due to record another video, because, you know, why not? She's got back and, ooh, she's putting something on the story by the looks of things. Let's have a look at this. Okay, it seems to be her ratings of the rides now she's ridden them. Let's have a look at this, shall we? Okay, wait, what? Like, how? You, oh, you can't, like, I can't, like, how can you, like, I don't even know. Hello and welcome to episode 7 of the Minecraft Quest to Build a Roller Coaster series. I am here in Kirsten's house because she always lets me, or from now on I think, well I kind of just walked in, whatever. We're going to start the video in here and then I think the rules are now that I have to stay out for the remainder of the episode. Uh, anyway, he No, don't do that! I'm going to die! Why did you do that? <laughs> don't! I literally... I <laughs> <laughs> what? I didn't actually think they were going to attack. I completely forgot. <laughs> That's that explains why I died last episode. I'm on 13 deaths now. Oh wow! Right, please. <laughs> right, good. That's four. Right, your your stuff's um, here. Your stuff's here. Just come quick, quick. I didn't think they were. I completely forgot, and I did that. It was your fault last episode, <laughs> then you. <laughs> So I told you, it's your fault. In episode, obviously we had episode six point five, but it was technically all episodes. Yeah, well, but, right. You know. Anyway, uh, uh, make sure you subscribe yeah. and, <laughs> and click the bell to enable notifications so you don't miss any more of this uh, madness. Uh, Me killing you, my dogs. Yeah. You got um, loads of stuff everywhere. Have I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's all over yeah, the place. It's a seed. Right. Yeah, it's just going right. everywhere. Uh, and, right, you always say something to comment. So, basically, uh, comment down below, and we'll do an Alton Towers one this week. Oh, I've still got my furnace here. I need to place that down <laughs> in a minute. But, comment down below. I was just thinking about this before. Comment down below, does you've ridden 13 and saw the ride, which queue line jump scare you think is scarier? Because I believe Saw has a queue line jump scare, and I know for a fact 13 does when it works. Because 13's queue line jump scare is often turned off. Yeah, I Did think you... it was when I went. Was it not? I don't... On? Because what? Yeah, I don't remember because... it being a jump right, scare. Right, basically, right, you don't. Because basically, uh, if you don't know, you probably know about this. And why is there a zombie? Uh, you are meant, or basically, in the queue line, you go into a room. I think you go under a ladder first and you go into a room and there's a massive cage in the centre and in the yeah, cage yeah. there is like a Tesla coil and basically those you've been on the ride will know that it counts up slowly to 13 and when it reaches 13 basically this girl screams and, the, and it's meant to go off and it's quite loud to say the least but it's not always on. Yeah it wasn't when I went. Yeah it wasn't but, on. Um... It, it is it is very loud. You can hear it from the station still. And then, yeah, it definitely wasn't on then. And then I believe Saw line has Saw's Q line has a gunshot jump scare, but I don't exactly yeah. know where it is. And I don't think it goes. Yeah. I don't think it goes off that often because I've it seen, does actually. It does go quite often. Like, does I'm it? Pretty much always get the jump scare. It's, it always it, scares me. <laughs> it's only at the start of the indoor queue because you go through that like yeah, tun just as you get indoors, it kind of goes yeah, off. And, yeah, and then you go like through the tunnel, don't? Because I've seen a queue line walk through. You go up the spiral, well, it's not spiral, the like stairs. You've got loads of stairs to go up, and then you're in. Yeah, yeah. And then you got the TV screens and stuff. It's a really cool queue, actually. 
It is actually. To be fair, Saw's just really well themed, like all around. I think it. It looks like it has the best queue line in the UK. Um, wait, what was I meant to be doing, mate? I, oh, I need a door. That's what I meant to be. Doing. I need. Have you got any gold? I doubt you do. Actually, I need well, gold well, for powered rails. No, because the one time I went mining, I died. Oh, Kirsten, you failed to get us gold. Oh, why am I coming back? I need a crafting. Where's my crafting table gone? Oh, I've got. Well, there's one in my chest, I think. Uh, I'm going to go mining for gold. Have you stolen my crafting table? I'm coming back in. I don't know. There's one in my anyway, chest. Anyway, Kirsten's going to love me for this. I think that now you've been to Alton Towers, we should have another debate that runs throughout this episode oh, what? while we're doing everything. What about how bad you think Smiler is? Even though no, 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 no. Right, it's more than that. So, on Instagram, before Kirsten went to Alton Towers, she posted her prediction for her... The ranking the big seven, and yep. I wasn't very happy with it. I don't think it had even been posted when we recorded last episode, but I can't remember. Yeah, probably not. And then this, um, right, and then she's obviously running all the rides, and the top ten has I, it's not changed as much as I thought it would. I think it in some respects it's quite similar, but then it yeah, is a it's bit to different. Fair. Like you thought it think I think you thought it would change more than it did. Uh, but it's not. And it's safe to say uh we're on about the big seven here and it's safe to say all I can say is oh dear. Um it's not looking too amazing in my opinion. <laughs> um so I think what we should do is we should should we go through we'll go through your yeah, a rank into the big seven and i think we'll have a discussion about each of them uh, yeah all right now would you all right is it going night yeah yeah it is oh, i'm gonna need... go mine in the morning get right. some gold i need to go inside i'm gonna need... try and find a desert biome now because i think there's there's not going to be a common. desert near here we're in a cold part of the world there's never going to be a desert here i know but um Gold is like much more common than desert biomes, apparently. Uh, so, well, if I can, no, it's find the one. it's the mesa biomes, the red deserts that are really rare. Uh, it's really because they have mine shafts on the surface. Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, anyway, would you like to announce your number one in the big seven, please? Well, it's got to be Smiler. Got to be. Kirsten thinks that I'm mad that she rates this as a number one coaster, but out of the things we're going to go for in this episode, I don't think it's the worst thing, because to be fair, you know, I've said that I think it's overrated and I think it'll be overrated. I but you haven't done it. No. You haven't done it, right, so stop. Say. Right, just stop there, right? I think, I've said I think it will be number three for me in the big seven. Um, but yeah, to be fair... A lot of that, I think. I mean, if it's a brilliant. Ah! Creep! Oh! oh gee, there's what? a creeper! There was a creeper! <laughs> oh my god. I think, Where I think... are you? I'm near the trees. I think I think that creeper. Oh, jeez. I think. <laughs> She's deaf now. I think that creeper knows what I was about to say about the smiler, and I think it's a fan of the smiler. So it he just... wanted revenge. He thought, how can you think now about the smiler? It was right. It was like, right, that's it. We live in a world where people don't appreciate him enough. I'm dying, mate, and I'm blowing you up. <laughs> Um, right. I mean, I see. I see why you would want to do that. Right. Um. <laughs> let, let me continue. All right. So I think a lot of my thoughts on the Smiler come down, or I think will come. Like I've said, it was a, if it's a brilliant coaster, it could be my number one in the big seven. But it could be. It's really good for me. The theme just doesn't do it for me. I do not like that theme. I it, love the theming. I love yes, it. I think it's, it's really original and yes, just like it's different and it is like unique. weird. It is unique. It is weird, but I just. For me, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense, and there's a lot of. Why there's... not? Why don't it make sense? It kind of it because... does make sense. No, but it's kind of well, it's very messed up, which could be. That's good the whole or bad. point, though. It's no. supposed to be all quiet. No, there are there are coasters out there like Lost Gravity at Wallaby Holland, which have unique themes that I think have brilliant themes. But with the smile, I can see why you like it because you like horror, and it is kind of a sort of horror theme. But then at the same time, it's all happy and it just doesn't make much sense for me. And I just, 
think they could have done more than I think they've it's done. It's kind of. It's it's th- re- it's weird. Um, I think more than it's supposed to be just to make you happy. Like they're trying to. It's no, it, almost no, kind it's of like not. they're trying to possess you it, and turn yeah, you it's into like an that, so you're kind of I mean. following them. No, so it is. It's, it's, you know. it's weird in that. Yeah, you've got it spot on there, right? It's like they are trying to do that, and it's kind of, in a sense, torturous. But then, in a sense, it's to make you happy. It's re- it's a really weird theme. And That's the kind of whole point of it. It's, I think it's in supposed a, in a way, to be. In a way, they want to brainwash you so that yeah. like you follow yeah. them. And in like a way, your, it's you know... it's really it's really confusing, um, but I think it's kind of meant to be like that because yeah, I think what I will say is that I think the ride they've designed around the theme fits it very well. Yeah, definitely. Be- like it is the perfect sort of theme to have for that ride. But as for the theme itself, it's just not a theme that I'm a fan of, really. And why can't I make birch doors? Oh, I'm not at a crafting table. To be fair, though, you can't lie, though. Even if you, you aren't a fan of the theming, right. it's themed very, very well. Well, the base, I think they could have like, done I think I, it. Is, I, just I think... think it is themed very well. Yeah. When you actually go there and see all of it, I think... and like, hear the soundtrack, it's themed right. very well. Right, don't, well, I don't like the soundtrack, and I'm not one to... Um... I don't particularly like it. it and it's a bit annoying. Exactly. But at the same time, you, it's Exactly, fits. you do think it's... I think it's one of the worst things I'm a score's ever done, in my opinion. No, but it fits with the ride, and that's the whole point. It's supposed it, to be very it kind does, of, you know... But I, I don't... It does, but then something's telling... But then something's telling me it could have been better. I think... I, I think the soundtrack was perfect for it. Like, I think that's kind of the whole point. Well, it's I very see, kind of... See almost why. like, honestly, like, after I went, that the theme, the kind of track, was literally stuck in my head the whole day. And that's the whole point, because they're trying to kind yeah. of hypnotise you. They and do kind that. Of, it does that know, very like, well. But I don't like the that's theme, kind and that's of, the thing. But maybe I'm not meant to it like is, it. It is, <laughs> it is kind of... It is themed very well, though. Like, yeah. I think, you know... I, I do like the downstairs room on it. I know I've never been, but I've seen it in virtual towers and I've seen yeah, it's it. Yeah, pretty good. I do, I do yeah. think that room's done. For me, one of the big problems is the station. It's not. I, I like. What I do like about the station is like the spotlights that like shine down on the train. Like I wish more coasters did that, but to me, apart from that, it looks quite a bare station. Like, to be fair, the station isn't. The station is kind of well themed, but not as well themed as the rest of the ride. I, I would disagree in it being well themed, to be honest, because to me it's just like a grey building, but yeah. No, I mean, when you're actually inside or when you're there, and it's, it is kind of. It is themed, it's just not as well themed as it, like all around not... the ride and everything. Like, it could be themed better, but at the same exactly. time, you walk through the end, it's good. Exactly. I like the ending tunnel on it. That, yeah, the ending that, tunnel's like the same yeah. really well. Right. Uh, what am I doing? I think I'm going to copy your sort of house design so it sort of fits. <laughs> Next. Alright. Get your own ideas. <laughs> She's not happy. Um, yeah, but mine's like birch and oak. Yours is oak and oak. I'm do- I'm using oak wood. Yeah, I don't I don't like birch woods. Birch is literally the worst word. I, just I like... It. You've got birch doors on your house. Uh, anyway. Yeah, because birch doors aren't that bad, but like, like actual birch wood is just disgusting. I hate yeah. it. Anyway, let's get on to your number two. Because uh, I mean, you see, I've always said the smilers rubbish. I think I've, I think I've just proved there that I don't think it's as bad as I sometimes make it out to be. But it could go either way. I think, I think the viewers can get a, have got a good idea. I bet you have that it could go either way for me that ride, like. It's hard. I've said it will rank at number three if it does well. I mean, there's a chance it could get slightly higher, but there's a chance. It probably it, will. The chance it could be down there at the bottom of the big seven, and we just don't know until I ride it. But yeah. Yeah, I mean, it is a really good ride, though. Like, honestly, it really is. In your opinion, it's a good ride. I think. Um, uh, to a lot of people, it's a really good ride. Yeah. Like, it's not just me that thinks that. Like a lot of people, it depends do, and, like, where you look. Reasons. Everyone in Instagram likes it. Most people on Twitter don't. There's a lot of people on Twitter don't like the ride. The it, same thing. There is a big there fan a, base of people who is, really like it. Yeah, but there's a massive age thing with it. I'm telling you now. 
older enthusiasts tend to not like it as much. Do you think my dad loves it and my uncle? Yeah, but are they enthusiasts? Are they enthusiasts? Well, they're not exactly GPs. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll leave you know them out. I mean, we'll like... leave them out. But um, I just know a lot of older enthusiasts that don't like pleasure. It, I think like it pleasure. What you look yeah. for in a roller coaster. No. It, in like, ver- in, you, you, know. you love inversions. For me, inversions don't make a better coaster necessarily. I but, think I love inversions, but at the same time, you can have an amazing coaster that doesn't have any inversions. Well, you I mean, know, it does depend. Well, that's it. Icon's an amazing coaster, and strictly speaking, although we won't get into this debate, it has one inversion. Because a lot of because strictly speaking, the Immelman or Junior Immelman isn't counted as an inversion. I okay, personally, yeah. it does feel like an inversion when you're on the ride, but I mean, I think uh, the Smiler or Icon is a lot of people's number one UK coaster. Yeah, it is. Those are very um, popular. But I, but people, but you could say that either is overrated. You could. I mean, to be, uh, I don't know. And I see why I both. Think it's... I think I see why both are overrated. Um, yeah, I think. Also, no, like, no offense to you, no offense to you guys who live down south, but you guys who live down south tend to be the people who say that icons overrated, and I think that that's because of the sort of stuff you've grown up with. Like, I don't know, people who seem to be surrounded by Thorpe a lot think it's overrated, but then you go up north to everyone who's visiting Pleasure Beach all the time. People who've grown up with Pleasure Beach seem to love Icon, so... And then... Yeah, I think it does look overrated, because obviously I've heard that, like, the launch is nowhere near as good as, like, Stealth Please, or anything. Please, right, I'm th- right, I'm telling you now, don't go in expecting a forceful launch, because you will be disappointed. I didn't go... I think I prefer, like, a forceful it doesn't launch bother... is really yeah. adds to it. But it like, just... when you go on yeah. Stealth, like, the launch is amazing. Right, it's don't get me wrong. UK. Don't get me wrong, I love Rita's launch, but the fact Icon's launch isn't forceful, I'm not bothered by it. Just pretend that bit doesn't exist, focus on the rest of the ride. It's not meant to be forceful, and that's the point, because Mac LSM launches just aren't forceful. It's meant to be how it is. It's yeah, not... I mean, I prefer, like, a forceful launch. Like, yeah. Stealth and Rita, they are really forceful, yeah, and they but... kind of... It really adds to the ride but, yeah. and the experience. The thing is, though, with Icon, the launch isn't... I know Blackpool kind of marketed it wrong by saying it's the UK's first double launched roller coaster because starters, it's not revolution is. Secondly, the launch isn't a big deal when it comes to the overall ride, or it shouldn't be a big deal. Yeah, but I think because the launch is quite weak from what I've it heard. Is, it's, it is. You know... It is literally. It it literally. It it. It, it's like you hear, it like says icon, you slowly start rolling forward and then you kind of gradually just speed up. And then, you, yeah, the, I mean, it's complete opposite on stealth second, and Rita, uh, yeah, like you're just uh, suddenly stealth, gone. Yeah, stealth is just like three, two, one, go, and then you're like at the top of it, it's ridiculous. Yeah, honestly, stealth, that's why I love stealth so much, is because the launch, you honestly, know, no matter how many times you ride stealth, the launch always surprises you how. I'm Quick telling you is. now, I'm bracing. And I mean that. It always I, I am. I am bracing myself for that launch, like literally. Oh, I don't. I stick my hands in the air and just like wait for. What yeah, but happens. you're used. To... <laughs> I bet it. Do you feel people... I haven't done stuff that many times? I feel like I, yeah. I don't know how many times in it. Maybe like. Uh, are you I'm sleeping? Not sure, are you sleeping or not? No, I'm in a cave. Yeah, but I. <sighs> for goodness' sake. Do some stuff. No, because there's mobs outside. I could get blown up by a creeper again. Well, I just fought off two creepers in this cave, so. I've you not should got, come I've... down, come down and do some. No, training. no, I've got zero weapons. Well, make make some. Yeah, but I've only got wooden stone. Oh, I found gold. Good. Right, I think. Right, we'll switch to Kirsten Cam, because. I think we'll switch to Kirsten Cam. We'll focus on Kirsten because she's finding gold, and I'll just talk for keep talking. Um, right, I've heard pe- I've so I've obviously ridden Rita, right? And don't get me wrong, the launch is forceful, but I've ridden it enough that I'm used to it. It doesn't it doesn't have that surprise anymore. I've heard people say that Stealth is much, much, much more forceful than that. Yeah. Like, what would you say? 
Would you say there's a massive, massive difference? I, I'm not sure. I think obviously Stealth is 80 and Rita's 60, I Stealth is the full... Stealth is the third fastest launch on any coaster in the world. Yeah, I know. I mean, Stealth is yeah. amazing. But, like, you'll be so surprised. Yeah. I mean, it is definitely better no, than I, Rita, I don't, but I don't, Rita is still amazing. No, no, I don't think I will be surprised, because I've, I've predicted Stealth will be like my third favourite coaster in the UK. Or I think so. I think he'll be higher than that, to be fair. It depends it, what sort of thing you enjoy in a roller it could, coaster. It could, though, it, like... Like, it, yeah, it could beat the Swarm. But I just predicted the, the swarm. swarm is amazing, but at the same time, I kind of because I've done the swarm so many times, it's just not all this lagging. It's just not kind of I don't know. I mean, I've said the swarm, stealth, and saw are all potential top five coast. There's a skeleton outside. <laughs> it's I'm in, only a skeleton. I'm in my bed. Don't wake me up. Um. Right. Anyway, on to your number two. What's your number two in the big seven at towers? Gotta be Nemesis. Oh, is it really? I'll let yeah. you off. I'll let you off. Nemesis, oh, great Nemesis. ride. It was my first favourite, but then I did Saw again. Sw uh, not Smiler. <laughs> Smiler again. And I was like, yeah, no, that's my yeah. favourite. Speaking you know of I mean. the Smiler, I have a theory. I have a theory that the Smiler was heavily inspired by Saw with the elements in it. Because I feel like it kind of was. They're both like it was, wrestlers, though. I, so I, I feel see, like, you know. I feel like that Merlin. W I don't think Merlin needed to do Saw better though, because to be, I think Saw will be better than the Smiler. Kirsten did until she rode the Smiler, so yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know. I think I mean I'm going to Thought Park again, um, like later this. Aren't you going like, next later week? in September? I thought you were going next so, week. I yeah, were... yeah, I'm going in like a week. I'm going on the twelfth, so I, yeah, that's what I thought. Like a week. You see, your um, rankings could change again. You might go and soar and think, that, oh, yeah, you might go and soar and think, thing. it could go and soar and think, oh, sm the smile is rubbish. That's the thing, like, like it, kind of, it definitely could change. To be I, fair, though, I don't think, because mine just was think, my favourite and saw yeah, that, so I don't know. I, I just think, to me, saw looks like the overall better ride. When you can, the, I think it's better. Themed. Yeah, I do get what you mean. I think it's better. Think the indoor section look. Wow, that looks amazing on Saw. Like, no, the indoor section is a hundred percent better than Smiler, but at the same. Oh, time, there's a strange noise outside. I think it's a baby zombie. <laughs> oh no! I'm sorry, but the Smiler's indoor drop is pathetic. It's yeah, it's, it's not great. The indoor drop and Saw is absolutely it amazing. Because like, you got it's so cause good. Because you, you got like. Because you got like all the fake blood and stuff, and I know I'm not into horror, but Sora looks Saw looks manageable, to be honest. It's so it's so well themed. It is, and in, to be fair, that dark ride, I think, that dark ride section, like it's yeah, the dark ride section is literally it's the incredible. best dark ride section on any coaster. I'm, I'm sorry, like, but that in my opinion, that does put the Smiler in terms of its indoor stuff to be to shame really to like i'm sorry but the sword just is better theme than the smiler by the looks of it it's yeah. just like... yeah I, I don't know i love i mean i love the saw film so oh, i that's, prefer the yeah. theming but at the same time and then, i don't know and then also even when you get outside it's inspired because you go to that vertical lift hill and then on the smiler you've obviously got i know because i've seen it on virtual towers You've obviously got the TV screens, you've got all the lapping. And then on Saw, you've obviously got the TV screen and then Jigsaw says, like, game over and starts laughing. It's so inspired by Saw yeah. the Smiler. Literally. I do, get, I do get what you mean. I like... don't think anyone addresses this either, but it's so inspired by it. And then Saw's obviously just a shorter ride, only three inversions. But like... it seems, I don't think Saw is a short ride. Everybody says Saw is short, but I don't think no, it, it is. No, it's just Saw af It's just short after the lift hill. Like, like over half the <gasps> ride. Diamonds! Sorry, I just had to... Yeah, I found diamonds! diamonds. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Hey, no, why does no one address the fact that the Smiler is inspired by Saw? I'm surprised no one addresses that. And they're literally... Saw's a Eurofighter. Smiler's an Infinity. Like, the Infinity they're coasters... they though, so I guess... Yeah, exactly. The Infinity is literally the same as the Eurofighter model, but with bigger trains. Oh, if I don't know, I personally think, though, that the Smiler mm. would be better with lap bars, because some of the Gerstler Infinity Coasters have lap bars. I'd love to do this. Yeah, I think it would be I, better with if, lap I bars. Bet it so would, I, I bet it would be my number one in the UK if it had lap bars, not going to lie, because 
To be fair, I'd love soul with lap bars. I think that'd be exactly. really good. I don't know if they do Euro fighters with lap bars, but I've... That is true, I've, but still, yeah. I think it would be really cool. Like, I've just ridden, um... I've just ridden, like... I just seen like the sm uh, no oh getting all mixed up. Gersla Infinity <laughs> Coasters uh, in Planet Coaster have lap bars, and like I just think that the Smiler would be my number one UK coaster for sure if it had lap bars because I've obviously because yeah. obviously I've I've done Blue Fire at Europa Park and I've done Icon and a lap and inversions with a lap bar are just amazing, a hundred times better. Yeah, they're, they're they so, are. They're, they're so much more comfortable. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I've ever done an inversion of a lap bar. You I won't, don't think I have, actually. You won't have. That's why Icon's so good for the UK. That, like, the fact is, it, they are, like, the comfiest trains ever on Icon, like, just on those cars. Yeah, they look, they look really good. They are. The trains play a big part in Icon. Yeah, I get what you mean. Oh, I the lava. <laughs> when you go on Icon, though, you need to go in there expecting a ride with a pathetic launch, because yeah, oh, yeah, I am expecting that. Just the launch, of the launch, I've heard. yeah, the launch is literally the worst part of Icon. Everything else is better than the launches on Icon. <laughs> oh, I found a mine shaft. And then, oh, have you? Steal yeah, all the track. That's really. That's good. really. That's, how, really, that's good. really good. Steal all the track. Plus, it's, it's level like seventeen, I think. So that's quite low. That means di that could mean diamonds, gold, lapis. I can't believe so... we've gone from having a really unlucky world to a lucky world in the space of a couple of episodes. Like, so it's because it's because of my mining, you know, my mining skills. Ow, I just knew I, I, I didn't mean to do that. Shot. I didn't mean to do that. I'm getting killed. Oh, <laughs> I, I thought he was boarding. I'm getting killed. Oh my god! I found more gold though. It's good. Die, baby zombie, die! Die! Oh, I hate ah, die. zombies, die. so annoying. Die! <laughs> die! 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 I'm gonna die! Oh I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! die. die. Oh I'll die! Oh my god! I'll How die. did you manage? I think there's a skeleton. I'm literally exploring a mine shaft and you die. Oh, it's, mo <laughs> it's morning! It's morning! It's died! Oh, it's morning. I got all, all my right. stuff back as well. I got all my stuff back. Yay. It's always so dramatic when I'm gonna die. I just start oh, I, I just start screaming. How did he When I die I just accept it. <laughs> and you don't go Oh god an apple. And, you don't, an apple. and you don't and you don't go like ah, there's a creeper <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Um anyway, um anyway, on to your number three. We need to get through these because otherwise this video is going to be real long the way. On to your number right. three in the big seven. Come on. What was that? Uh, number three. Oh, what's my what's my third? Like, why can't I think of it? What's number three? Oh, Oblivion, Oblivion. Now this is where me and Kirsten need to have a discussion. I'm sorry. I love Oblivion. I'm sorry, but it's one drop. It's one drop, and don't get me wrong, it's, it's, it's an mm. amazing drop with an amazing build up. But I'm sorry, it just does not deserve. That park has some brilliant coasters, and Oblivion just does not deserve to be at number three. I mean, one for of me, amazing coasters. For me, is. yeah. For me, I should mention Nemesis is, is at number two, like it is with Kirsten, and Oblivion for me is at number. Oh, let me work this out. Five. Uh, it's, okay, it's above, five isn't it's, too bad. It's above first. At the it's, same time, though, yeah. like I'm this little person, I kind of like I love stealth, even though it's short. I love it, and it was literally yeah, my number you, one coaster for that's ages. That's another thing. I kind of enjoy the short kind of thrills, yeah, if you know that, what I mean. Yeah, but that's another thing. You rate Oblivion above stealth? They're literally the same ride, except stealth Wait, has a launch, but then a, and then I also a vertical drop. Above. I don't know if I rated Brob, did well, I? Well, you did when you put it on your Instagram oh, story. Oh, I can't remember, to be you fair. You did. I'll you probably did. change that when I go again. I, I'm just, and I'm just like, to you, how could you rate Oblivion above Stealth when they're literally the same thing, but Stealth's vertical drop is slightly bigger, they're, and it has that amazing launch. I know they're amazing. They are very right. different. Like, yeah. The actual ride experience is very yeah, different. Yeah, I know it's like. very different. I know Stealth's like, heads back, hold on tight, raise yourself, blah, 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 three, two, one, go, launch, off you go, and Oblivion's like, like this massive build up, but still, I'm just the both. I don't know. Oh, I found more diamonds. Jeez, I'm a little well lucky. What's wow. up with this? Right, 
but and then Oblivion. Don't get me wrong. The uh, build up on Oblivion, the whole queue line with the free pre-show videos, it's done very well. But I'm sorry, for me, it just does not deserve to be that high. I, don't, I just think it kind of Oblivion has a special place in my heart, just because it was my first ever like proper yeah. first ever of like the big seven at all times. I mean, I must say, I must so say, I, guess, I must yeah, say, I'm a bit just like. like yeah. I, I must say, I'm a bit like that with Icon, to be honest. Oh, it's so special, blah, blah, blah. So, that does influence my opinion on Icon as well, but... Exactly, it does depend on, like, yeah. your experiences and kind of, like, like it's what gonna... sort of place yeah. you prefer. Oh, shh, Tommy. Well, family <laughs> channel. Cursed. That was close, that was a close one. Uh, but only about the third one in the set. Like, yeah. Yes, you um, know, I'm, not, I'm doing pretty good. What is that? Oh, God, that's a creeper. Oh, he's fine, he's bobbing With me, it's like, oh, it's a creeper, and it's just oh. like, oh, God, it's a creeper. You can see all my screen, he's just bobbing around in the water, <laughs> yeah. and he can't get to me. <laughs> oh, it's funny, I'll kill him in a bit. I'm just going to get this lapis. I just accidentally punched the sheep. Sorry, sheep. Oh, that's so horrible. How did you do that? He's not that injured. He's, he's still dashing I'm around. I'm going to get lost in this. I better head back, because I've got, like... Exactly. I've got 12 diamonds on me. Please get lost. That's pretty good. Please get lost, then it's not me humiliating myself for once. Uh, I have 12 diamonds, which I may share with you if you're nice to me. Please. And I have lots of gold and iron. I have some of it that's right, melting. So... so I kind of want to get back, yeah. if you know what I so, mean. E Just so what? we can actually progress yeah. with the coaster. I think it was... So even if I roast your Alton Towers Big 7 rankings, will you still give me this iron? No, it depends. Depends how mean you are. Right, um... You might really upset my thi upset me, like how Right, I think we've talked... And if you do, then I won't want to give you right, any Right, we've talked about Oblivion, it's a special ride to a blah 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 on to number <laughs> four. <laughs> um, right, what's your number four? Uh... In your rankings? Uh, thirteen... I think... I think... Is it thirteen? Uh, oh dear, it's thirteen. I don't know, actually. I can't think. Considering, I'm quite disappointed. Considering we've not, I love thirteen. We've not, yeah, but we've not got to the best family coaster in the park yet, and I'm quite sad. No, I think we have actually, because I think thirteen is the best family coaster, and it's the yeah, most in your opinion underrated. It is the most underrated coaster in the UK. I'm sorry, like that I'm, is just no. That is just how it I'm is. Sorry. It's the most underrated coaster in the UK. I'm sorry, but it's overrated by you. Yes, it's underrated, but it's overrated by no, you. No, it is not. A lot of people agreed with me when I said it was no, but overrated. A lot of, no, it is. No, a lot of people didn't agree. I've read this. I've read your Instagram story. Oh no, I had a lot of people message me and say how much they agreed with me because yeah, it's really sure. underrated and it's a great coaster. Sure, right, and worse. And I loved, I loved the drop in it. It's just a really good coaster. Yeah, it's well done, but it just. It's quite a tame coaster, and it just, yeah. It just... It's not that tame, but at the same time, I disagree time, when. Like, I do disagree. It's just really yeah. fun. I do disagree. Like, I enjoy some coasters yeah. that are just fun. Like, it, sometimes that's nice. I know. If you know what I mean, rather than, like, a proper, like, fill on, like, smiler. I just really enjoy it. It's quite, you I... know. Right, um. I'm... Plus, I like the theming. Like, I like any sort of horror theming yeah. I love. Right, shout out to Ella from Theme Park United, but Vampire is better than 13. Oh, it's not hundred percent not. Vampire is forceless. I'm, I'm guessing Vampire It's is not silly. forceless. It is forceless. It's not. Like, I literally it's a brilliant coaster. Except for the new soundtrack and announcement. I thought the new soundtrack's pretty good though. No, it's awful. It's just I don't know, I don't know if I've actually listened to it. <laughs> it's better than the Smiler's soundtrack, but it's not good. Uh, I don't know. I like the Smiler soundtrack if it's the ride. I think I may be lost. I'm guessing I'm guessing She's lost! Get in! And I'm here, running around, the building thing is, my house. I won't be screaming at creepers. I'll find my way home. Yeah, but you're you lost. See? Yeah, but you you're, see? You're lost. You're lost. Well, I'll find my way back. I'll just f try and follow the torches. Right. Just... Anyway. Oh, okay. No, I think I've kind of found my way back. Anyway. Well, um, I put a furnace down. Where's I'm, I'm, guessing, I'm guessing you saw it on Ella's Instagram story, and I'm sure lots of the viewers did as well about... Uh, Oh no, it wasn't. For the, no, she said the dragon, and then I said to her a joke. 
the, the vampire's dragon. better than the dragon. The dragon's no. rubbish. No, I said no. Hate I said, it. I said to no because it who was it theme park Avengers said to Ella uh, that the dragon's better than thirteen. Oh, that and is I not. found it really. The thirteen is definitely better. And I, and I just I and then I just found it hilarious that he was making thirteen to be like that. So then, I met, and then especially after you like said, oh, it's underrated and stuff. So then I messaged Ella as a joke saying, the... yeah, the dragon's better than thirteen, and she just messages me back like no it's not and then it's not 13 is so much better and then I, and then i messaged how to... can anyone say that no and then i messaged wrong. and then i messaged her like but vampire is better than 13 and she's just like no nah, it's not it is vampire it really 13 is. is better 100 it is, is better, better than right uh, please stop slagging off the dragon because i quite i did like it the but then it was young so... It's, I literally did it like four no, years it, ago when it's... I was tiny, and it was still really tame. Like I literally thought, Jesus, what is is this no, even a coaster? No, like, what, no, what it... an excuse for a roller coaster! I can't Honestly. believe you said that. It's better theme than the Smiler. <laughs> no, it's not. It it's is not theme. No, it's definitely right. not. That's wrong. We, should... I'm sorry. It it just is. It's better theme than the. It is. It really, and then it's just, and then the dark ride section at the start is so cool. Oh, it's nice. Honestly, the drops that so bad. Isn't no, it? it is. You get loads of hang time over it. Oh, I know, but it's just really bad. I just like, re- you get hang time, and it's like, oh yeah, no, that was really bad. I just bad. remember doing the dragon when I was tiny, and thinking, wow, this is an insane coaster, and it was like my number one. <laughs> Oh god! It was. I don't know. It was. It's not a great coaster. Not it is. It's just not great. The theming's really good. It's not. It is. The smiler theming's definitely better. No, it's not. That I love that. It I is. love that castle. It looks so good, and they've like upgraded the it. The castle's really. good, but at the same time, like they've like upgraded it. Build for a better, build a better coaster can you, for this epic castle, can you, like can, please. Can you please stop slagging off Legoland? Because you slagged it off last episode as well. Yeah, it's just not. I just please can you I stop? I want like the thrills in the please, theme can you park. Stop? But, like, there's literally none in that park. Well, there's not in Chessington, but you love that park. Oh, no, there is in Chessington. Dragon's Fury in Chessington is no. really good. Please, could you stop? And obviously there was Ramus's Revenge, but Please, obviously that's gone. stop. Stop slagging off um, Legoland, because otherwise if you keep... She's not a big fan no, of but it. If you keep... right. No, but if you keep slagging off Legoland, tabs from Tabs Lights theme parks will cry. Because <laughs> she because she worked there. Shout out it's to you, good, by I the mean, way. I mean, it's a good park, but at the same time, it's just not my sort of park. It's, like, it's not the sort of thing that I enjoy. It's brilliant. No, but it's... You know, I respect anyone who's, like, if it's their No, favorite, but it's like, a really... If that's the sort of thing you like, then full respect. Yeah, the, the, rides, time, like, the rides are not... thrilling, but for me, it's just a really well-done park compared to Chessington. It's a nice I, park. I mean, I definitely prefer Chessington. It just, it's just a better all-around coat, all-around. No, it's just... Everything, oh, am I lost? everything so about annoying. it, ap- everything about it, apart from Dragon's Fury and Vampire, is worse than Lego Land. Nah, I'm definitely sorry, not. but it is. It's like Scorpion Express is decent. I don't even care. It's a good ride. Plus, it's, a it's better than Fly. Of, it. It's better than Fly with Fish. I hate to say it, but it is. It is because it's of just the better themed. I will admit that Chessington is quite well themed, but just the overall, ah, oh, it's just and doesn't plus, do it Rattlesnake for me. And plus, Rattlesnake is really good. Like, honestly, it's a really good one. I know it said, I know it said it was rubbish last episode, and I take it back a bit. It's all right, but it's just not not the best Wild Mouse. I think it's a really good one to be fair, but you know. Yeah, how long have we been recording? Oh, we need to get through your other five. Of, oh. I feel we've been recording ages, but I've tempted to carry it on. I'm sorry I said I was going to do shorter videos, but <laughs> I'm tempted. Right, so your number, four was, your number four was 13, I think. I think it was. I, I, right, you know, I think it, you're right, I think it's too high. What's your number five, then? Um, uh, I think it's Rita, I think. No, actually, I think it's either Wickerman or Rita. Right, stop right there. Wicker what? man. That low down. I'm sorry. Oh, no. I found my way out. I found my no, way no, out. No, 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 no. Wicker man is the best themed family coaster in the UK. It's just the best. It is very well themed and I it do is. enjoy it a lot. It's, it's just better not theme. as good as the it's other coasters. Theme. It's better themed than the smash. It's, it's, it's quite intense in places. 
Some of the some of it is to be fair though. I exactly. think they just had a bad ride on it, if you know what I mean. Well, I they... mean literally, literally, oh, I was literally the last ride of the day, and then the next day they were doing track maintenance on it. And plus, you've so... not seen that pre-show. You know what? You know what? Yeah, I did miss the pre-show, which was probably a big part of it. It I is. It, if I it the does a massive. It, it would add to it. It it plays a massive part. It is the most amazing like pre-show for a coaster you will ever see. I'm not gonna lie. The atmosphere created in that room. Like, oh, Enderman. Hello. Like, yeah, the, atm chase the, just the atmosphere. Oh. You know what? Let's let you off, but still, I think it's a bit low. And plus, she said it's rough. No, I didn't say it's rough. I mean, it's like, it's quite rickety. It's you not know what I mean? rough. It's quite shaky. It's not rough. Oh, there's a witch. No, 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 I don't like witches. Oh, it's only a witch. It's not that bad. No, but the oh, throw potion. Do you want me to kill it for you? Please you kill, it. kill it. I'm hiding. I don't like witches. They throw potions at you. It's a good job I saw that. Or I would. Look, well, watch me kill. Watch me kill this coaster. Not coaster. Witch. witch. Go on then. <laughs> oh, it's lagging. <laughs> the witch is just stood there, and you're like, just stood there, like. Well, no one's doing anything to each other. Oh. Oh. Oh, I got a load of potions from it. That's cool. How did you kill her uh, in one shot? I got, I got, I got a glass bottle. How would? How did you get? How did you? Off? How did you kill her from from one hit? Oh no, it, it took a couple. Like. Well, bit. and then she just lagged and died instantly. She was like stood there and then like. Yeah, she just died instantly. Um, <laughs> yeah, insecure, eh? Right, what's your but number? Anyway, what should Any... I do with my diamonds? I don't know, but hmm. what? What's your number six? What's your number six? It might be Rita. I'm not sure if it's Rita or Wicker Man. I can't decide. Wicker Man at number. But... Six. I'm sorry, Wicker Man at number six. No. No. no but the make thing it your number is, five. I love Rita. Like, it's no. a really good ride. No, please just make your Wicker. Just make. Just make. Um. Just make uh, Wicker Man number five before I cancel the series. <laughs> I'm only joking. <laughs> you would really do. Oh wow! All right. Me and Kirsten, well. no, me and Kirsten, I'm not, I'm being serious now, me and Kirsten legit had an argument because I threatened to cancel a series on her for a reason I don't want to go into in this video because it's, yeah, it was a stupid reason, but I said I was going to cancel the series and Kirsten got really annoyed, well not really just, annoyed, but. I was just like, why? Honestly, no. I was just don't... And Kirsten's friend. Whenever you get annoyed, you just threaten to cancel the series. And, and like, then, fine, you're lost. And then Kirst <laughs> and then Kirsten's friend had a go at me as well. <laughs> well, was... I think you deserved it. Not for my life. No, at the time I was. <laughs> and what just... should I do with my diamonds? Make yeah, a but pickaxe. yeah, but you wouldn't give me permissions on the world we were on. Yeah, well, it was my world, and you just randomly joined. Yeah, that could literally do nothing. I couldn't even open the door. I couldn't place blocks. I couldn't destroy blocks. I couldn't. <laughs> it was funny. It wasn't at the time. You were having a go at me. Mm, it's just I don't. I just I don't even know. I'm sure that zombie's been alive all episode. <laughs> it was, and then and then and then Kirsten's and then your friend was. I'm not. I don't want to expose her. She's like messing you like. And then you join our world and start having a massive paddy because you don't have any. Oh, you, you did. That I is, didn't. I said. You what, did. You had a full on paddy. I didn't. If I were. What did I say? Well, you were just getting really annoyed, and I was like, "Well, it's my world. I can do what I want." <laughs> What was the FaceTime call for like for that? Because I remember you were on FaceTime at the time. Well, no, we were on we were on FaceTime, just like having a right old laugh. We were like, "What?" Were you? Oh, yeah, it was quite funny. <laughs> You're laughing at them. Um, so your number six, right, Rita? Fine, it's that low down. It is. What's your number seven? Um, Galactica. Right, I will let you off on that one because you said um. It's because of my brain condition. Yeah. Well, I was I wasn't going to mention it because I didn't. It's because of my big brain. To, but... Oh, I don't mind it. <laughs> yeah, basic right. Basically, Chris has a brain condition, and it's really uncomfortable for her. It is uncomfortable for a lot of people that ride. To be fair, not personally for me, uh, it's not too bad. I I enjoy it. I rate it at number four, and I rate Rita at number seven. Uh, I'll just clear this up now. Thirteen is six. Five is oblivion. Two Three. Three, I predict, will be the smiler. 
two Nemesis, one Wicker Man. That's my Alton Towers ranking. I have I have a gift for you. I have, have a, a gift. gift for me? Ah, I'm coming yeah. back home. Oh, no, I'm here, I'm here. Oh, right. no. Ooh, Diamond Boots. Not Diamond Boots, I've got Diamond Boots. Oh, I, I, just, I just was expecting them to be Diamond I didn't really look, to be honest, you know. <laughs> no, I've got I've got an Iron boots, Sword, no. now I can kill look all my, the Reapers. Look at my Diamond Sword and my Diamond Boots. I won't I won't attack you because otherwise I'll get killed by the dogs again. But <laughs> Exactly, or I'll just kill you with my Diamond Sword. No, don't. We don't. <laughs> I think we need to end. I think we need to end this now. I feel like we've been recording oh, yeah, a while. Oh, we have to. So let's go back to the house. Your house. I've still what got. What's my? It's because my house is gorgeous. How have I? Look how have I still? Look how cool it is. Yeah. How have I still got full hunger? Like, really? I don't know. My dogs are just staring at you, like. <laughs> right. So I've obviously done some more work on my house there, and I mean, Curse has been mining, got lots of gold and diamonds and stuff. Yep. So yeah. Um. It's been quite productive, actually. We've had a bit of an Alton Towers debate again. Um, <laughs> yeah, as usual. I don't. I, I think I was a bit nicer than last episode with some of the theme parks and rides mm. that we discussed. I think I was a bit. Nicer. Okay, I guess. I mean, Kirsten, you know. Kirsten gave me some boots, so I must have done all right. Today. And I gave you a hoe. Yeah, I've got a hoe as well. Um, uh, yeah, I, I don't. I, basically, and we just, we shovel. just. Basically, you're gonna have seen some footage cut there because basically, uh, you know, you know, we, we didn't feel like that this needs to be included in the video. You know, there's a, no, you know, secret. we we thought Top we thought, secret. yeah, basically, me and Kirsten have pretty much, um, we basically uh, we we said some stuff that we didn't think was appropriate for a family channel and some other things happened, so we've cut some of the footage out. Uh, just at the end of the video, we thought it was a bit long as well, so we, you know, we've decided just that we're going to cut this uh, bit out that just before, so that's why you're going to have seen a bit of a cut here, uh, but yeah, uh, make sure you subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss any future videos, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time, bye! Say bye! I said bye, 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 bye. <laughs> it cut out again, bye. Oh. <laughs>